We're taking a quick break from Bali for a visa run. Let's pop on over to Kuala Lumpur for 48 hours. One day running around the airport will be easy and all the signs will have your flight on it everywhere and not at the wrong end of the terminal. Another country is on the list. <laughs> Nearly. We're not there yet, but we're getting there. Is Chloe a Fendi girl? I'm a Fendi girl in a Fendi world. You booked this business class, right, babe? No, we only get business class when we get real Burberries. I'm wearing fake Burberries, but still in the economy. Can we just say Malaysia Airlines may have the coolest safety video? Satu, dua, tiga, jom. Let's review the main aviation safety conventions. It's really not that difficult. Seatbelts are mystical. <laughs> How you know you're on an older plane? The in-flight gaming and texting options. I'm hungry and thirsty. You're always hungry and thirsty. That's mm -hmm. so what happens when you follow the signs. The signs don't tell you how to get out. They just lead you to buy more things. Chloe in another country. Number, I don't know, 20 something. What's count? So we just got to our hotel and as much as I wish I could just stay on this comfy bed all night, we have things to do and places to see. So what's on our itinerary for tonight? Pedaling Street Market. And we're going to walk so we're going to see what we can find on the way. Yeah. We might end up somewhere totally lost down an alleyway drinking beer with randoms. Let's do it. <laughs> so I don't know if I ever actually told you this. But Patronus Towers is one of those buildings that's on my list of like major buildings in the world that I want to see. Yeah? Yeah. That's so now we get to see it. Because it just so happens. Best educational thing about Hong Kong. Drink a tag of beer. I like mint thing better. Food section. Food. Is there any food here? Food, food is still the bar. But here I have the little. Said have okay. a little bit. Popular place, babe. Thirty-one orders. How many? Thirty-one orders. That's what you do. That's what you do for good food. You wait. because on our way over to Bali, moving over to Bali, I don't know if we have a post about this, but we had way too much luggage and we had to throw out pretty much a whole bag full of clothing. So now we really don't have anything to wear when we're like in the city or anything like that. So first stop shopping and then we're gonna go check out the sites, do all the fun stuff. Let's go. shopping but you're not allowed to go to Gucci and Louis Vuitton and Chopard and De Beers and Rolex and can't go there. No. Five floors of shopping. I may not live through this. Walking 
Coffee tasting flight, single origin flight. We did the tasting flight. So you get two different coffees. You get an espresso, and then you get a like a pour over thing. I forget exactly which ones I use, but this one is two regions. This is Brazil and Indonesian beans. This is Brazil, Indonesian, and Papua New Guinea. <laughs> I don't know if I like that. Oh, okay. It's very bitter. Like, I wonder if they over extracted the shot. Oh, no. Over extracted? Oh, yeah. Great. So, we didn't get very far, but we made no. it to Gravy Baby. Gravy Baby. So, we thought some wings sounded good. Yeah, we need, we need a snack and a drink. So, we're getting some tiger beer and some buffalo wings. Not exactly Kuala Lumpur Malaysian cuisine, but we just like need to eat. Right? Hey, it shows that it's a metropolitan city and you can get anything goes pretty What does the American think? They're good wings. They don't have enough buffalo sauce. Uh-oh. Hey. Hey. Where are we going? Dinner. Dinner? Yeah. Will you be my hot date? I'll try. Okay. I got the date right now. Hot parts hard. <laughs> it's some Italian. So you mean not Havana, not this Cuban place? Oh, uh, that's after dinner. Oh, that's after dinner. What do we got? All their wines by the glass are like ten dollars. Nice. Questo è tuo ristorante. Yes, this is my uncle restaurant. We have been here since 2001, so 23 years already in 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 the business. Nice cocktail, we import all the wine from Italy. We have a, a wood fire pizza. Pizza is amazing, light, crispy. Yeah, it's nice. Yeah, go in, go inside. And we use only the best Italian ingredients. Uh, buon appetito. Grazie. And this? Authentico. Caramel pasta Havana bar without seeing your face. It's a lot better. Bow bow. Bow bow bow. We didn't stay Havana. It looked like a really cool place, but like it just didn't have that vibe to like sit down for an hour, comfy, and smoke a cigar. So now we're gonna go to the cigar bar that's in our hotel. It is cool vibe. Not much action last time we walked in there to check it out, but let's go see what it's doing. So what do we got here, baby? These are Oliva series of, way back when the family made cigars in Cuba, but now they're in Nicaragua, which they're a good little inexpensive spot. So what do you think, baby? This is my first Nicaragua. Nicaragua. <laughs> it's really nice. It's like really chocolatey, tobacco, bit spiced. Guys, I never thought I have ruined dirt. <laughs> or made her better? You've expanded my right. <laughs> yeah, no, I just have trouble. No coffee yet? And the coffee's really bad. Yeah. But this is absolutely a Chloe breakfast. An omelet because she loves her eggs, or an orange juice because you know vitamin C, and all the papaya that was left on the counter. And she's probably already asked twice for wives that they don't have. Chloe breakfast. And then we have a classic Matthew breakfast. No, no, you <laughs> didn't record the big plate of beans and omelets and hash browns 
That's true. The beans, um, the hash browns, the fruit, oh, the yeah. chicken, freaking teriyaki, rice, whatever other stuff you got. But then the finale. <laughs> They're little. They like equal one donut. <laughs> we found a restaurant to see if they have coffee. So we don't know what we got, but there's coffee on the way. Supposedly. Yeah. It's like Vietnamese iced coffee. Yeah? You haven't tried it yet. I haven't tried it yet. It's like super sweet and tastes like condensed milk and it's cold and refreshing and perfect for this sweet. So it's super sweet and refreshing and perfect, just like you. Yeah. Oh, just like me. Thanks, baby. Oh, we're going now? Yes. Batu. Batu caves. Batu. Batu. Batu caves. Apparently we didn't pick the best day or to time. come. Or time. <laughs> Jam because we're going to get there a lot faster this way. That's where we're going. 242 steps to get up here. We made it! Woohoo! <laughs> So we were done with the stairs. Get inside, and there's more stairs. Survived the train. That was an experience. Okay, we gotta find some food. Yeah. We'll um, be back. I think we've arrived. Where? Little India. <laughs> Roti, rice, curry. So excited for you to try this right now. Flavor is that? It's spicy. It's, it has so much flavor. Like I could just sip this gravy and I'd be satisfied. You've just gone straight in with your hands, babe. Mm. It's easier. Yeah. I think I found my new favorite pairing: chicken curry and, and lime. Okay, lunch down. That was some good curry. That might make our next trip India. Could could very well be. Good. Probably the best meal I've had in the past, like since we arrived in Southeast Asia. That's interesting. It's like a custard or something. Yeah. Yeah, so Central Market isn't as much fun. It's very clean. Some palm tree rice cream. That was good. Palm tree rice cream. That's a fast 48 hours in KL. Made even more special by Lunar New Year. Thanks for watching, make sure you like and subscribe below so you don't miss the next adventure.